Hi and welcome back again in another tutorial. This time we are going to make a gemstone, crystal, or whatever you call it, fancy stone, something like that. And we just get started using this mirror to let's sketch the gem. You can make whatever shape you want. sketching the shape alright that, that looks good and we continue to the rendering step which is the color I want this blue let's see make a new layer For don't forget I don't really use the this another side because we are just we are going to cut it and flip it over. Make selection. Turn off the symmetry. Just block out. All right. Duplicate. Flip. Now we're done blocking it. Uh, let's rename our sketch. So to multiply. All right. Here we have it. In this step, I want to uh, give it a texture to the back on the base color here. Let's give it more texture. As you can see, I like to give more color so the color is, it doesn't feel flat or alone. Give some sprinkle of other color. Maybe yellow here and there. Also, if you want to add something inside the gems, like, like a motif or something. Let's see. I want to make this shape inside. And because of this is a, a crystal, it's going to reflect an other side, like here. And on the top. Right, the reflection is done. New layer. Um, clipping mask. Multiply that. Put the shadow color. We put the shadow on, on the top because it's a translucent, semi-translucent like that. So the light will gather on the bottom part. The light from above will merge into the bottom. New layer again make clipping mask now we are blocking for for the highlight we going to use polygonal lasso soft soft brush maybe or texture soft brush like that remembering the the light we're using the light coming from above maybe a little from the side maybe like that slightly from like that maybe and we're just going to lessoing this the light is coming something like this in this area right here and also from the other side and here just follow the shape more like that okay it's kind of look begin to look like a gemstone right 
maybe this lighting here aren't quite good because the light is coming from here so the light is on this side around this side maybe like this let's fix the the wrong thing so this is from the another side of the light so this can't be the highlight right here right and that will look better and now we are adding the scattering light inside the gem we are using the more vibrant color to enhance the inner part of the gem we have the overall information we need and now we are continue to render it Use the color dodge to enhance and use color burn with low opacity to enhance the dark area And we are finished. So let's call back the important thing in the lighting on gemstone or crystal. With the gemstones or crystals, there is two lighting that works here. First one is the lighting on the surface. This lighting behave like like a normal normal uh, 3D shape the highlight is facing the the light source and the second lighting is the inner lighting or like the ambience light inside the gemstone when the light is gathering in the opposite side of the light source all right now we get the things we need to know and let's give this gem a frame
that's it guys see you next time and have a good day